Ceramic capacitors are an indispensable element of practically any electronic circuit. They are used where it is necessary to work with signals with changing polarity or good frequency characteristics, low loss, and some efficient leakage currents, small size and low cost are required. However, problems connected with the manufacturer technology gave this type of capacitors a niche of low capacitance devices. A 10 microfarad ceramic capacitor has been considered exotic recently. Nevertheless, the technological development has allowed several companies to claim reaching a capacity of ceramic capacitors as high as 100 microfarad by now. To understand how it was possible, let us talk of technologies. Let us have a look at the structure of a Moretta multilayer ceramic capacitor. The capacitance of a multilayer ceramic capacitor directly depends on the thickness of the dielectric layer, the number of dielectric layers and active area of the electrode. We can increase the capacitance by decreasing the thickness of the dielectric layer or by increasing the number of electrodes, their active area of the dielectric permeability. The decrease of the dielectric thickness and possibility of increasing the number of electrodes is the main way to increase the capacitance of ceramic capacitors. However, a decrease of the dielectric thickness reduces the disruption voltage, therefore high capacitance capacitors with a high operating voltage are rare. Look at these ceramic chip condensers of 100 microfarad. They are rated for 6 and 3 tenths volt. Obviously, high capacitance capacitors can replace tantalum or aluminum condensers for surface mounting in ripple rejection circuits, dividing the DC and AC components of an electrical signal and integrating circuits, and so on.